Fluvial is a term used in geography and geology to refer to the processes associated with rivers and streams and the deposits and landforms created by them. When the stream or rivers are associated with glaciers, ice sheets, or ice caps, the term glacier fluvial or fluvioglacial is used. Fluvial processes Fluvial processes include the motion of sediment and erosion or deposition on the riverbed. Erosion by moving water can happen in two ways. Firstly, the movement of water across the bed exerts a shear stress directly onto the bed. If the cohesive strength of the substrate is lower than the shear exerted, or the bed is composed of loose sediment which can be mobilized by such stresses, then the bed will be lowered purely by clear water flow. However, if the river carries significant quantities of sediment, this material can act as tools to enhance wear of the bed. At the same time the fragments themselves are ground down, becoming smaller and more rounded. Sediment in rivers is transported as either bedload or suspended load. There is also a component carried as dissolved material. For each grain size there is a specific velocity at which the grains start to move, called entrainment velocity. However the grains will continue to be transported even if the velocity falls below the entrainment velocity due to the reduced friction between the grains and the riverbed. Eventually the velocity will fall low enough for the grains to be deposited. This is shown by the Gilstra M curve. A river is continually picking up and dropping solid particles of rock and soil from its bed throughout its length. Where the river flow is fast, more particles are picked up than dropped. Where the river flow is slow, more particles are dropped than picked up. Areas where more particles are dropped are called alluvial or flood plains, and the dropped particles are called alluvium. Even small streams make alluvial deposits, but it is in the flood plains and deltas of large rivers that large, geologically significant alluvial deposits are found. The amount of matter carried by a large river is enormous. The names of many rivers derive from the color that the transported matter gives the water. For example, the Huanghe in China is literally translated Yellow River, and the Mississippi River in the United States is also called the Big Muddy. It has been estimated that the Mississippi River annually carries 406 million tons of sediment to the sea, the Huanghe 796 million tons, and the Po River in Italy 67 million tons. See also equals fluvial landforms equals equals related terms equals lacustrine of all relating to a lake maritime of all relating the sea oceanic of all relating to an ocean palestrine of all relating to a marsh references